But behind closed doors, I'm a fool for your love beautiful people so today we are headed to Fayetteville Arkansas we're eating at a burger place called Hugo's um, we heard heard nothing but great things about it even calling the airport and um, asking questions like courtesy car stuff and all that they're saying yeah Hugo's is the place to eat so thrilled to do that we're also excited because we get to take our friend Kathy today who has never been in a small plane so it's gonna be a really great experience for everyone um, it is perfect outside blue skies um, Lots of planes already up, so we are excited. We will catch up with you soon. The summer's calling. The summer's calling. If the kingdom is overthrown. Meet me at the cornerstone I know that I can't be without you This bond is solid gold We're a diamond and an emerald It took me forever to find you Cause when it's all over The love that you give Will be there to guide you Meet me at 
at the corner store. So lunch was incredible. We'll give you the full skinny on that in just a little bit, but we headed back to Drakefield and there's an air park, um, not air park, of course there's an air park, it's their museum. And so we've been walking around here. If you fly in, then you don't have to pay. Um, otherwise, if you drive in, it's, I don't know, 10 bucks to walk through it. Lots of planes. Um, they have a big C-130 setting out front and then we're just like taking it all in. So how cool is this? Now we've been through the cold and darkest day. The summer's calling. Drakefield in Fayetteville, Arkansas. Went with our good friend Kathy Best. First time flying in a small plane, and it was yeah, fun. it was fun. It was fun. <laughs> it was fun. So we went to a, a restaurant called Hugo's in Fayetteville. Landed at Drakefield and drove up there in the courtesy car, and had really good hamburgers there. Ours or mine was a jalapeno burger, and Kathy. And mine was a blue moon with oh the blue cheese. Blue that cheese. you die for. Yeah. You and die for. Mine had jalapenos, pickled jalapenos, and a bunch of pitter, pitter, <laughs> cheddar jack cheese. It's really good. And we got fries, and the burgers came with chips, and everything was really good. Service was good. Really cool atmosphere. Uh, a lot of fun, and definitely would go back. Definitely would recommend it. It's downtown. It's in a basement, uh, which is really cool. It's a college town, Fayetteville. The home of the Razorbacks, I guess. Yeah, anyway, but a really neat atmosphere and great food. Yes, I agree. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. Okay, so I get to do mine all by myself and I had the guacamole burger and it was very good. And the great thing about that guacamole burger, um, so I had to eat it with a fork, which I normally really hate with a hamburger because I like to like two fist it, but it had so much guacamole on it that that, that was the choice. So normally people skimp on guacamole, not this one. I think I had a whole avocado, which was so, so good. Um, the fried chips were homemade and they were really good, but we got a basket of fries, add a little salt and you have got it. And I love it because it was also um, craft beers. Chose not to drink today, but we definitely bought some, brought some home. So we'll have to give you a review sometime on that vanilla. What is it, Greg? It's a milk stout looks really really good so absolutely hit up Hugo's um, I can't say a bad thing about it and the atmosphere was absolutely incredible so we will let you know where our next little trip is and um, have a great day the summer's cold.